So, uh, next I'd like to talk about the different knots that I use, and I only use two different knots. One's a bowline, which I will show you um, afterwards, uh, and the other is a sheet bend knot. And the sheet bend is going to be used to attach your bungee to your shooting line. So, say you shoot a fish, you can't get the, um, shat, the flopper back out of the fish, you're shooting a slip tip, uh, it's much easier to kick your line loose from your bungee and pull all the line out. So at that point, you'll be kicking it loose from your bungee, not your shaft. So here, here we have a sheet bend. Now, how do you do a sheet bend? Super easy. If you can see that, what it is, say you need to kick this loose. You literally just, I found it easier to kind of bend that down a little bit. And then that'll just slide right over top. And you pull it right out. So to redo that, you've got your loop. You take that, you slide it through, and then you wrap it around the shank of the loop and tuck it back in on itself. And then you'll just pull that tight. Like that. At that point, that's not coming loose. The tighter you pull that, it, it tightens on itself. That's not coming loose. So again, you wanna kick it loose, bend it down, slide it. Just that easy. To do it again, put it through the loop around the shank of the loop, then back in on itself, like that. And you can give yourself more of a tag end or you know less tag, however you wanna do it. And the tag is how much you have sticking out there. That's your tag end. And that's it. I like to have it kind of snug. And just periodically check your mushroom heads here. Uh, that really keeps it from coming out. It shouldn't come out either way. I've seen some pretty bad ones, so yeah. But yeah, I like to have a good, mushroom head on there it keeps from sliding so anyway that's it